All right, what's up, guys? Legend here, and today let's revisit Super Saiyan Go Tanks just to torture myself. Um, now I know I should be doing a video for Gogeta and Vegito, but I'm still working on Vegito, and I have yet to pull Gogeta. Like my luck to me has went down the drain. I think all my luck went towards the Tag Fours and Hellfighter 17. So I think there, that's where my luck has went. So in terms of this unit here, 14 stars, stats wise, could be better. Um, aged not that greatly. And this man already needs a Zenkai just by looking at the stats. Like, I don't even think a Zenkai will help this dude, but at very least he needs one. And he doesn't do anything spectacularly that I can remember from back in the day. But his green card is kind of his forte a little bit in order to buff up his blue card. And his ultimate arts just inflict the paralysis, which wasn't bad. But that 40% can honestly leave you guessing. So I don't really expect it to always land. And I might make this a short film because this is going to be torture. <laughs> uh, his kit, uh, nothing does nothing like his old tech his man ability does nothing but draw the arts and he buffs fusion warriors and I fight if I remember correctly he is the first fusion warrior in the game I believe I don't remember I don't remember and he has one of the stupid abilities in the game taunt now if he doesn't get hit he has a plus 50 percent to key recovery which is okay but again, he has to not get hit in order for that to stick around. So that's going to suck. And he also comes in with 4% blast damage for 20 timer counts, which is not bad. Here's the thing. It's basically hybrids, and I'm basically going to be using, at best, the top three. But if I have to, I will probably change out the yellow Goten for either Pan or for um, the red Trunks. And I'm giving him a Zenkai buff. Now, I thought he could be Zenkai buffed by two. But it's only by one, so I have to make that work to the best of my abilities. And like I said, this might be a uh, short film because I'm not going to dedicate too much time and effort into this unit. So, uh, yeah. With all that said, let's jump right into it and see how well he has aged.
So, after all that, this man is definitely in need of a Zenkai, among other old units from back in the day. And again, he released around the year ones. And I want to say this guy was the very first fusion warrior or fusion character to release in the game. If not him, then maybe it was Ray Gogeta. And again, the only issue that I had with this unit, personally speaking, was the fact that this taunt ability. I don't like this ability because you are never guaranteed the satisfaction of holding onto this because almost anything could, could end it. A tap shot, tap attacks, blast arts, strike arts, ultimate arts, blue card, you name it. Anything could kill this. So if you got a Zenkai at best, I will take this away and give him 50% key recovery automatically. Which his key recovery is not that bad. It, the only thing to me that's bad is defenses while his offensive and health is pretty good. So I still think there's viability somewhere within this unit, but I don't know, man. I don't even think a Zenkai would even help this unit at best. He will probably be a bench character for, let's say, maybe Hybrid Saiyans. Like, let him buff Hybrid Saiyans with his ability because we don't have another purple Zenkai buffing Hybrid Saiyan in the game. So I'm pretty sure he will make a good fit for it. So uh, yeah, like I said, expect some revisits, wonky teams, and whenever I can, I'll probably do a showcase for Vegito at Zenkai level 3. Kind of like a progression thing, see how, see how well he's aging with that, but uh, yeah, that's all I can really do until I can get lucky enough to get Gogeta, and like among other content creators, I'm waiting on the free play Broly drop, so with all that said, till next time, peace.